question states that an example of unicellular gland is and the options given are first option salivary gland salivary glands are multicellular glands so this cannot be a correct answer b bruner's gland bruner's gland is also a multicellular gland so this cannot be a correct answer third option goblet cell yes goblet cell is the unicellular gland which secrete mucus so correct answer to this question is option number c let's see fourth option also gastric gland gastric gland is again a multicellular gland so this cannot be correct answer and correct answer to this question is option number c goblet cell moving to the next question Question states that S.L. Miller created electric discharge in a closed flask and observed amino acid formation by mixing which of the following components at 800 degree centigrade and the options given are first option H2O2, CH4 and H2O. Oxygen was not taken by the S.L. Miller in his experimental setup so this cannot be an answer. Second option CH3, CO2, hydrogen and water. This is also incorrect because CH3 and CO2 was not taken by S.L. Miller in his experimental setup. Third option CH4, H2 and H3 water. Yes, this is correct combination. Methane, hydrogen, ammonia and water was taken by S.L. Miller in his experimental setup. So, correct answer to this question is option number 3. Let us have a look at the fourth option also. CH3, H2, SO2 and water. Again, this is incorrect combination. CH3 and SO2 was not present in the S.L. Miller's experimental setup. So, correct answer to this question is option number 3 that is C. Moving to the next question. Question states that the infective stage of malaria causing pathogen in humans and its site of storage in mosquito respectively are. We have to find out the infective stage of malaria causing pathogen. First of all, you must know malaria is caused by which pathogen? Malaria is caused by plasmodium. And infective stage of plasmodium for human beings is sporozoids. Let us see this is sporozoid is given in which option? in option B and in option C. In option A and D, trophozoid and gametocytes are given. So, A and D cannot be a correct answer. And these sporozoids are present in the salivary gland of female Anopheles mosquito. So, storage site is salivary gland of the female Anopheles mosquito. So, correct answer to this question is option number B. Proceeding to the next question, question states that linking of two fragments of DNA became possible with the enzyme and the options given are first option restriction endonuclease, this is incorrect because restriction endonuclease is a molecular scissor, it is a cutter, it cuts DNA at specific points while ligases are the molecular glue which links the two DNA molecules. Second option DNA ligase, here is the answer DNA ligase, DNA ligase link to DNA fragments. So correct answer to this question is option number 2. Let us see third and fourth option also, third option is alkaline phosphatase. Alkaline phosphatase remove phosphate from the 5 prime end of vector only to prevent its self ligation. So this cannot be a correct answer. Fourth option catalase, catalase is not responsible for linking of two fragments of DNA. So correct answer to this question is option number 2 DNA ligase. Now proceeding to the next question students and question states that choose the incorrect statement with respect to nervous system of cockroach. Scientific name you know Periplaneta Americana. Let us see the options. First option consists of series of fused segmentally arranged ganglia joined by the connectives on the ventral side. This is a correct statement. Second option three ganglia lie in the head and six in the thorax. This is incorrect because three ganglia lie in the thorax and six in the abdomen. Third option. System is spread throughout the body, perfect statement, 
support statement head holds a bit of a nervous system while the rest is situated along the belly part this is also correct and this is the reason if we cut head of the cockroach it may survive for few days so as we have to find out the incorrect statement and incorrect one is the b statement so correct answer to this question is option number 2 that is b now proceeding to the next question